YouTube Try Stars, Try Stars Trucking. In this video, I'm actually going to try an experiment. And basically, my radiator burst. The plastic at the top of the radiator on my truck. I mean, I don't know. Maybe you get too much, too many heat, or maybe it 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 do it do with time, too much pressure. I don't know what it is, but it burst. For more videos like this, please subscribe. Actually, I'm um, in Pennsylvania, um, taking a load. Wanted to reach my delivery early as possible, so I ran over the weekend. Heading to my destination, I was climbing the hill on the 81. There's, there's a you know, couple of hills on the 81. So I was actually climbing that hill. Um, then I looked, I looked through my rearview mirror. I saw a lot of smoke coming from my truck. Well, my nothing wasn't showing on my dash, but I'm like really no so i pull over put my four-way flasher on and um stop shut up the engine notice there's a lot of smoke coming from my truck you know so i come out you know look before because you know there's a lot of vehicles coming by so you know you have to get over on the passenger side to make sure you're safe because you don't want anyone to run you over right now i uh pull my 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 wood over and looking inside there and i can see that the engine is all wet you know uh, when I look, I saw the the, the red uh, coolant on the, on the road running. So I'm like, okay, maybe it's a hose or something burst. I'm not sure what it is. So, you know, I use my light to start look like look around and see what it is and stuff like that. In 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 my checking, I actually I didn't see any of the hoses have any leak and water was still in the reservoir, but it was like halfway right. So I um go back in the truck. Turn it on, look at my dash, see there's there's no code and I start the truck and I can see where the water was actually spraying at the top of the plastic at the radiator. I'm going to go outside, I'm going to show you what I'm actually talking about. Now, I call, you know, roadside assistance. I'm in the US, like I said before, and the price I got was, the guy said to come with a record to get me, would be 650 and to do the radio he asked me what type of truck is it i told him i said to do the radiator in the morning would be 2400 i'm like 2400 he said okay so 2400 plus that 650 you know we're looking at 3000 3050 dollars right oh my god i got it right yeah i uh wait until the truck cooled down and i look where the closest uh truck truck stop was i, I had a one bottle of coolant in my truck pocket that's why it's always necessary for you guys to keep yourself stuck with at least one bottle of everything you know i throw I, I i throw it in the truck i wait on the truck to pull on right here on the side of the road throw it in the truck i pull the radiator cock off so that it, it will uh eliminate the pressure you know you don't build the pressure that quick to have it spray out so i i remove the cart the radiator cart and um from off the, the reservoir and i drove to the closest uh truck stop there is and i came there and that's where i i buy more rate ready to fuel and whatever whatever now i'm thinking of going to a uh a, driving to a shop and to get it fixed but in my mind because fixing it in, in canada is cheaper for me than the us now i was thinking now this is my thought and i'm gonna try it if it works it works if it doesn't work it doesn't work right Not, nothing be to try it on a failure because the thing is it, i have to change it anyway now what is inside my head is to glue, I mean like, JB Well. I'm gonna do a JB Well, and I read the package. Now this is all in my head because when you mix this stuff together, it, it actually get tough and hard. So I'm gonna prove it to see if it actually works. No, you see I'm smiling because I know I'm crazy, right? Um, I, I read it because I was in the truck shop stop and I was, I was actually reading it. It said metal, wood, plastic right cement fiberglass concrete and more that's all those things on it I, I know i saw something it's a set in six minutes work on multi uh multiple surfaces right um i saw something on it that got my attention like, let me let me say you know what i'm gonna try it hold on let me let me try to find it um what did i saw i saw something that said okay it said six uh, six it said set in six minutes curves in four hour if temperature is below 40 then set 
said time is longer. It's a clean repair area to dry grease and oil and rust, etc. Alright, that's not that's not what got my attention. Something got my attention late, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm trying to find it. Something got my attention. Hold up, hold up. Ah, where is that damn thing? So you mean to tell me it was all in my head? Come on, try stars. Oh yeah. The strength withstand temperatures up to two hundred and thirty Fahrenheit. That's the heat. And this thing it says two thousand four hundred and 24 psi and the temperature up to 230 and my on my clock on my dash is telling me 250 and 250 is actually when it go way over you know now do you guys think you know what i'm thinking you guys may be wondering why i'm so happy and i'm i'm, I'm break down why why being upset you already break down it's one thing to get moving is fixed right now i'm gonna JB, I'm gonna mix these two things together. And um, but what I did wrong is I I threw I I I fill it back up with coolant, and it's actually coming up out of the part that I wanted to well. Now I'm gonna go outside to show you guys what's going on. If it don't work, it don't work. You know, TriStar is gonna tell you, right? But I want to get back to Canada, which I want to get back to my mechanic shop, which get this thing done. You know. Now let go outside and okay. So I pull. I, this is what I did. I, I pulled the cork off. And I was using this. So this is where the leaking is taking place. Right on top, right here. If you guys can look. Hold on, let me see if I can dry away some of this water. So this is where the leaking is taking place. If you guys can look, the crack is right here. Right here, go all the way in here. And I think, I don't know if you come back here, but I know it's, it's, it's from right at this here right here as you can see if i if i move it you can see where it's actually moving right so um and it go all the way i'm trying to drop some of this cool and so I, I can show you guys what's going on but i think i think i, I need more I'm, I'm gonna go get um more um to, to dry away this hold on okay so i'm back cleaning away all this coolant cleaning away all this cool now if you if you guys look you can see like it's actually falling back up because I, I fill the reservoir up and the water is running in the rail so what is happening now because it's in the rail it's running through here it's coming back up as soon as I wipe away you can see that coolant so what I'm gonna I'm gonna pull something to put the coolant in and then throw it back in and the, the, the thing is the coolant is not cheap because it's 17 dollars for a bottle of coolant oh man you guys can see what I was explaining to you guys the the temperature that it actually go up to 250 and it's funny because I just did my injectors and now it's 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 this is this is another problem yes yeah, so after went out after come outside and screw the top the top um holes at the top um, I use a flat screwdriver and remove it and um, I cut one of the empty bottles and Put the coolant in it i'm back with my experiment and i don't want you guys to miss nothing so i have to go back in so this is it this uh every duty uh coolant it's like a it's not really water it have a oil in it like a oily thing base it's like an oily coat base with a lot of things in it so it really feel like oil so i'm trying to clean the area so i i go for my dishwashing liquid you know, you gotta, you gotta have the dishwashing liquid in the truck. So I go for the dishwashing liquid and a toothbrush, an old toothbrush I have in the truck. So I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna actually clean the area with the, with the dishwashing liquid of, of uh, water. So this is me at work. What I did, I, I removed, I removed this. You, I uh, use a flat screwdriver, screw this, and I remove it from here, from here. So what I did, I, I cut the bottle and and I catch about the the coolant in it. You know, so I remove this one, put the coolant in the bottle and catch the coolant for what was coming from here. So now I'm actually cleaning the area. So this is my water that I have in the truck in my bottle. So this is my water. This is my toothbrush with the, uh, the dishwashing liquid on it. So I'm actually just cleaning the spot for any 
coil or grease uh, fill this area with the JB. So I'm just gonna clean this area. That sound, mm, that's my bunk heater. Now I'm actually wondering if, maybe because the time is too cold, if this thing is actually even gonna stick to the surface. I'm just pulling pulling them out, 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 out the package. One says steel and the other one says hardener. So, if you can look, it's the hardener and this says steel. So we should mix the both of them together. So let me see how much should I put apart, you know? Okay. Now, it says, it actually states on here that um, if it temperatures below 40 degrees, um, no, 40 Fahrenheit, it's going to take a longer while to set. And it is below Fahrenheit, um, 40, it's uh, way below it. So I'm guessing it's going to be a lot longer time. So I'm just going to get... Um, something to mix it on uh, been eating eating these uh, rich bits on the other day so, so I get it's a cardboard basically I'm gonna mix it so I need you just gonna you just gonna be compromised now I need something kind of more stiffer than this to get it mixed well let me see if I could find okay I got a plastic knife I got a plastic knife from one of those food I'm gonna it so it said it said uh, put equal amount on there and immediately immediately uh, put it on because it takes four minutes four minutes to actually uh, dry I, I I close I close over the ba the, the bonnet because uh, I want the heat on the engine to keep the engine warm basically, so this thing could dry a bit quicker. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna put half of the tube on each. This is like half half of the half of the JB. I have nothing to lose right here, even though the J this JB thing is like eight dollars for it. But I mean, so oh my god, to know the difference. So I'm gonna just put at the side to make sure I got it equal. Okay, this should be good enough. It should be the same. Okay. So now it's time to work the magic. So we got to mix both together. That's what it says. Mix both together and get it put, put on within four minutes time. I'm going to put more hardener on it. Which one is the hardener? Okay, this is the steel. I'm going to put more hardener on it just to make sure that Arden should be the one to actually make the magic happen. So, you want to put more Arden on it. Oh man, this thing is... Oh man, what type of smell is this? Peeps is not a wonderful smell. This thing smell like... Okay, let's go Let's go outside to apply this on the radiator. to On top of the radiator to see what's the verdict. Okay, so this is the surface. Peeps. So let me apply the... Um,
Okay, you two. So, this is this is what's going on. I plastered it. You can see at the back. I plastered. So, I'm just actually going to wait. Yes, peep. So, I finished the experiment. You know what I mean? I did what I told you guys I'm going to do. If it doesn't work, I'll just get it fixed. Because, I mean, there, there's no other choice. But, I just spent like... Eight dollars for the um, JV thing, and for the three bottle of coolant, um, it ran me. Overall, it's everything was sixty dollars, sixty something dollars for for everything I just. Oh, here's a receipt. I gave eight um, eight dollars, and I and I got about nineteen dollars change. So it's sixty sixty dollars and thirty eight cents for everything I just purchased. So let me see if the $60 semi fix is gonna take me over. So what I'm gonna do, I have I have some lead back. Well, not a lot, but I have it lead back here on the paper. In the truck is kind of warm. So I'm not gonna judge everything based on what's happening in the truck. But what I'm gonna do is see if this actually hard. As soon as this gets hard, I, I know the, the process, the same thing is going on on the outside, right? So I'm, I'm just watching this. I'm going to test this. And as soon as this get hard, even though um, I think more, more is out there. So it's, you know what? I'm going to give it like a hour or two hours. I'm going to sit here for two hours. Yeah, I'm going to sit here for two hours and let it set. Or maybe I go more if I go outside. And all depends on what's going on. So thanks for tuning in. You know, it's try stories, trying something, trying a quick fix. If it does work, then you guys will know. If it doesn't work, you guys will definitely know. Thanks for tuning in. Try size trucking. Please subscribe if you're not already. And leave me some comment. Tell me, tell me anything come to mind at first. You know what I mean? I want to hear what you guys have to say. I, I, I want to read and laugh, okay? Try stars is back again. No, it's not two hours, right? It is 40, um, 48 minutes since, right? But... I was checking out this thing here, right? Hold on, let me turn around the, the camera so you guys can see what I'm talking about. This this thing here, I moved it earlier. It, it moved because it didn't have enough to hold it down. But what got my attention is it is it is like hold on, like um, the Ardner didn't didn't finish mix out of that. But what got my attention is basically this thing is, is tough like a rock Wait, hold on let me see if I get, where's my knife yeah this thing here is is actually a hard plastic it's a hard yeah so it's basically yeah basically it's a, it became a hard tough tough plastic so hopefully it can stand the pressure so it's just 45 minutes just 45 minutes since since and this is where i mix it on right so it's just 45 minutes since so i'm just actually playing around right now to see how how sturdy it is all right all right here here's a more, much thicker piece and the knife can't really can't really bore it and it's just 45 minutes in the... Um, I'm going to wait the two hours like I told you guys. Because, I mean, it's a lot of pressure, right? So, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a mechanic shop in. And um, see if the truck can take me there. If not, um, I, I'm, I'm hoping that it will take me back into Canada. But if not, you know, we have to do it the right way and done. But this is just a temporary fix. I'm just going to see if it actually works. So... I will tune it, I will be tuning him back. Thanks. One hour and one and a half hour since it's it's there uh set. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go outside, we're gonna check it, you know. What I mean I'm gonna screw the hose back on, I'm gonna um ensure that uh everything is 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 back together, you know what I mean? Look at it um carefully and then I'm gonna full full back the the radiator up and um i don't know if i should stay a bit longer 
or I should try it, you know, like try to go. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just thinking about it. But nevertheless, we're gonna go outside and check it and see what it's like. Okay, YouTube. So this is it. Um, no, <laughs> YouTube. YouTube, I'm actually laughing right now. This thing is hard as a rock. Oh my God, this look like it. YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Honestly, no, this this feel like it's gonna work. Yeah. Listen to that. No, YouTube, this gotta be hit. This, this right here gotta be hit. It, this is a temporary fix right here. No, okay, let me. Let me put the water back in and um let me let me screw back this stuff together and 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 see and see and see what I what I come up with. Okay. Where's my screw? Alright, I'm gonna screw back this thing. Um you need a flat screwdriver. Screw 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 the Hose back on okay YouTube so this is what's going on right now um, so far this look this looks sealed not sure if it's gonna work but I'm gonna I definitely try it you know what I mean it look tough it feel hard like a rock honestly this is really a steel okay I I full back the reservoir well I, I need another bottle because it's it's at low I put the two bottles that I add in there so um and i and i and i tighten i tighten back this i'm squeezing it right now i'm not seeing any any water spraying up like what, what was happening before so maybe because the heat don't touch it as yet I'm, I'm squeezing it i'm not seeing normally when i squeeze it i, I see water spraying spraying right here but there's none so let me start it and watch it okay all right youtube so i'm just gonna watch it i'm gonna make uh you press this right here to make the R rpm go up to make the engine warm far faster so that's what i'm gonna do and watch it you know you know what come to think of it um i'm like an hour away from the the the, the mechanic shop that I want to go now the engine is actually cold or cool I'm just gonna drive yeah I'm gonna drive to the next to the to the mechanic shop hopefully I can reach there because there I want to go if not wrecker is gonna take me there so I'm gonna use the cool engine to go normally I should take the, the, the radiator cap off so that the pressure don't build but for the way uh, oh, I'm feeling that thing if that doesn't work oh my god God, we want to take on a journey. Thanks for tuning in. Sorry, no, it's try slice trucking. What, what, what's, the, what's the name of it called? JB. A JB or JMB? Yeah, JB Welding. JB Well. So, all right. Thanks for tuning in. Try Stars. You too, Try Stars. Oh. This is what I'm doing. I'm actually uh, mixing, mixing another one to put more on top of what was going on because uh, I think it need more. Um, I'm, when I'm finished, I'm gonna explain to you guys what's going on because it's actually work. It actually take me to where I wanna go. Yes, on the journey, the same journey. Um, the JB welding worked. It worked halfway because I can see where some uh, a little water is coming through. Maybe it's too thin for it. And also, what I did wrong, I I screwed the the, the radiator cap on. I was hesitant on doing that and I know I shouldn't. I should have released halfway so that the pressure could um, not build. But anyway, I, uh, I'm, at a, I'm at a truck stop, right? And I stopped to, to just, just to check to see, see, see what's going on because I, I went to the mechanic shop uh, last night and they told me they're not gonna be able to do it until two days within two days or something like that um they, they have to go get parts and 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 all that you know what i mean and tomorrow and so i wasn't upright so i i, I just went and look 
where, where, where I was, you know what I mean? And I saw where just a little water coming out of what I did, right? So I came back and I buy, I bought another um, set of JB Well. No, no, this is what's going on. I buy it. I was mixing up because I'm saying, okay, I'm going to use all the tube and everything, everything, and just put it, I'm just going to just plaster it, you know what I mean? Make it be very thick, you know? But what happened is while I was doing it, I took the camera up to video to let you guys know what's going on. And within, within five minutes of mixing, this is what happened. Hard like a rock, and I don't even get to put it on the radiators yet. Hard. So I I have to went back in the shop, in in the in the truck stop, buy another one. No. So I have to went and buy another one. No. And and look 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 almost ten dollars. Call it ten dollars. Nine ninety nine. No. I'm not going to waste any time again. I'm just going to put it on, right? Mix it up and do it fast. So I, I will show you guys the video after I'm finished. I'm not going to, no, no, no. So I'll be right back. Try stars. I'm not going to waste any time again. I'm not gonna take too long, so I'm gonna go outside, put it on truck, and then show you guys after. Tube, try stars, try stars, trucking. Yes, I went outside and I did what I told you guys I was gonna do. I put the, the other, um, I plaster it this time, you know what I mean? If it actually leak this time, then I know something is off, you know? But yeah, um, this is, this. I'm gonna show you guys, uh, how it look what it look like and what I'm gonna actually do and if it work it work you know yes YouTube so this is it this is what I did um, I plastered it so you can look you can see this is what it looked like on top it's hard like a rock so hopefully it stand with withstand what's going on to take me where I want to go um, I, 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 I loosened the reservoir cover so it, do, it doesn't build pressure so I just uh, let, it, let it stay loose so it won't, it won't build any pressure so I'm just gonna work with that so when, when, it, do, when, it, when, it, when it doesn't build pressure that means it won't force post this thing off yeah so this is it so thanks for tuning in try start trucking um yeah if you're not subscribed already please subscribe you know what i mean and thank you guys for watching and being here all this time so peace out try start you too try stars try stars trucking and i've been driving for uh three and a half hours since i fixed um since I well the, the, the radiator so I'm gonna I was watching my needle I was doing everything you know what I mean and I you know I, I, I wanted to get fuel so I came to a fuel station so now I'm gonna check my radiator to see if I if I have any if I'm okay that's it and, and if it's leaking if it's fixed or not and if it can take me back to Canada or whatever needs to be done, it's gonna get done. So this is Troy Star Trucking. Thanks for tuning in and let's go inside the truck and see what's going on.
Well, YouTube, you saw it yourself. I mean, the JB welded, well, JB well, really stand up to its, its, its work. You know what I mean? Um, I'm surprised myself, like I said. Um, I know the, the, the few mistakes I made in the first video when I, when I was doing it in the, the, yesterday, you know what I mean? In my head, I'm saying I'm just doing something because I feel like doing it and it makes sense in my head, but not knowing that that product really stand up for what it says. It says uh, plastic welding and it's plastic welding, you know what I mean? Cause you guys saw it yourself, you know? So what I, what I did wrong, and I noticed this after, was I didn't spend enough time to mix both things together. Cause if you notice, I see I, I didn't mix out the the white substance, which would, would be the, the, the hardener. I didn't mix it out properly. That was one. The next one is I didn't wait. I didn't, I didn't give it long enough time to set. I drove off a bit too early. So it caused it to get a little crack in the middle. So what I did, I just went back over and just do it back all over what I did before. And it hold it, you know what I mean? So far, uh, my, my rate, also my radiator cap, I did, I did, I, I had closed the radiator, which I should have cracked it like what I did now so that the pressure don't build and try to find wherever is weak to get out. Now, it says on the, on the, on the package that it takes six hours to fully set, four to six hours to fully set. It still haven't been six hours yet because I just drove three and a half hours. So I still not even four hours yet. So maybe, I, but what I did, I, I sit up for two hours. I was waiting. So yeah, I just want to say thanks for tuning in. You know, it's Charles Star is trucking. It's a quick fix, you know. Um, this will should get me back to Canada. So that's that. That's my best bet. And when I get back to Canada, I will replace my radiator. But I mean, uh, it saved me that record fee, and um, I'm grateful. So, JB, well, I mean, well, well, you guys, you guys, you guys did it. Thanks for tuning in. Try slash trucking. Peace. Leave me a comment. Tell me what's up, where I go wrong, what should I, what, what I should have done, or just leave your, leave For your more comments. videos Thanks like this, please subscribe. subscribe.